Today I want to talk about soil, making soil. When I first moved into this property near the sea here on Moreton Bay, my soil, if you call it that, looked like this. It was sand. The further down you went, the yellow it became and the best you could hope for near the surface was a slight graying. Needless to say, it doesn't look very good for the purposes of growing vegetables and other plants. Even to this day, fruit trees don't like growing here. For the simple reason, there's very little down there for them to go plunging their roots. Today, 10 years later, this is what my soil looks like. And as you see from the activity in front of it, it's full of worms. So if you want a rich sandy loam like this, full of these wonderful creatures, you have to work on it. Especially if you live on a sand dune near the sea. Every time I turn over the soil, I get these little creatures. Where are you? There you go. They love it. And of course the colour has changed. It's jet black. All over. And what caused the change? That. That there is grass clippings. And this soil turned black because over a 10 year period I collected grass clippings. I got local lawnmower uh, I got local lawnmower men to drop off their grass clippings rather than dump it at the tip. They'd put it on my front nature strip, I'd bring it round the back and spread it as mulch on the garden. Now I get to grow a lot of vegetables. My topsoil isn't good enough for fruit trees because it's not very deep but for vegetables and herbs I'm a, truly away.